we're all home. We're living through this quarantine period. For people who are used to going to the gym, mm -hmm. now they're converting to calisthenics. Talk mm -hmm. to me about the differences, plus or minuses, between calisthenics or working at the gym with equipment. And also, a lot of people now, you know, we, you're an expert at this. Most of us, 90% of us are not. How long should our ex exercise routines be um, for us to see any type of gain, whether we're trying to lose weight or gain weight? Sure. First thing is consistency. If okay. you brush your teeth, if you brush your teeth two times a day, every day, you'll decrease your chances of gingivitis. You'll increase the whiteness on your teeth. It's consistency. It's the same thing with getting proper sleep, same thing with eating nutritiously, same thing with keeping your stress levels low and exercising on a consistent level. So let's think about that first. Yep. The first question people are going to the gym and now they're doing calisthenics or body weight exercises. Continue your schedule, continue your ritual. So if you wake up at six and you like to go to the gym at 6.30 and you have your pre-workout shake, still do that. And if you live in a studio, set it up where you walk over, get out of bed, make your bed, walk across the room, and do your calisthenics. Maybe it's sprinting in place. Maybe it's grabbing a video offline. Maybe, maybe in, in, in essence, it's doing burpees or whatever it is. So set that time as if you're going to the gym. So okay. consistency with your rituals. Now, when will people see results? That's the billion dollar question. You'll see results the minute you open your eyes. And what I mean by this is this, Sean. People have to remember, we all are somebody. Sleep is a consistent thing that you can implement. So say you're getting now eight hours of sleep. You're going to wake up in a healthier mindset. If you implement the rituals first thing in the morning, that's going to carry over into what you eat. What you eat, now you got proper sleep, proper sleep feeling good. You're going to then choose healthier choice, vegetables, water instead of soda. Also, too, what you're telling yourself throughout the day Remember, what you, what you tell yourself is who you attract. So if you tell yourself you're crap, you're going to attract crappy people. If you tell yourself you're crap, you're going to have a crappy life. It all starts with those first three things, emotional, spiritual, nutritional, and then the physicality. People are like, wow, that's so much. It's the proper way that we can create sustainable outcomes. Now, if you never exercised before and you want to do it during this time in quarantine, you start off by getting proper sleep, writing out your rituals, and then at that point, walk in place. The easiest workout, stand on one leg while brushing your teeth. It builds core, creates symmetry because we're all asymmetrical, mm -hmm. and you get a whiter smile. You have to start off small. When I work out, I don't time it. I go until I feel good. If I have 15 minutes in the morning, I'll work out 15 minutes. And that may consist of stretching, jumping you know, jacks. This, and I'm so sorry to cut you off because this sounds so counterintuitive. You know, it is. I'm just, I'm on the other side of this, right? Yeah. You're Jay Cardiello. World famous. You've worked with some of the biggest people in the world. You have a body like a Greek god. I want that body. Many people who are going to be watching this video want that body. But... It just seems so counterintuitive to me to think I'm going to work out until I feel good. That could be 15 minutes in because I just want to stop. I'm going to tell myself I feel good and I'm going to get the hell out of there. Yeah. So, you know, it, this is so against everything that we've heard and your work speaks for itself. So I'm not questioning your work. I guess I'm just trying to really change my own mindset. And I know that these are going to be the questions that so many of my audience are going to be asking themselves. Like, you know, this, this just doesn't sound like anything we've ever heard before. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.